Welcome back to your home garage and in this video I'm going to talk to you about popular styles of oil filter wrenches. Now first of all, oil filter wrenches are incredibly beneficial. If you are technically inclined, it's much more convenient to change your oil at home than by setting up an appointment and visiting your local garage. With the right tools, including a professional oil filter wrench, you can do the job yourself. One of the worst things that can happen when you're changing the oil is discovering that your oil filter is stuck and you don't have the right tool to remove it. So an oil filter removal tool will help you extract any type of filter by giving you a strong grip. Once you purchase an oil filter tool, you'll have it in your toolbox for years. The only expense you'll have is the oil filter and the oil itself. And don't be that person that uses whatever tool is handy to change the oil filter. The right oil filter removal wrench will help with particularly greasy and jam filters. If you don't use the proper tool, you risk damaging your vehicle. Okay, now let's look at some popular types of oil filter wrenches. First, the socket or spider style wrenches. Socket wrenches have metal or plastic socket shaped cups and attached to the bottom of the oil filter casing. They typically have a 3 8 inch ratchet handle but come in several sizes. They're useful if you have a little clearance around the oil filter or have a recessed oil filter. Some models of vehicles require a socket wrench. The main drawback of this product might be its tendency to slip over the cap. It's not a big issue, but it does require you to be incredibly careful with the wrench. Also, the item might get loose over some filter caps, depending on the vehicle. Next, we have the strap or band wrenches. If you have an SUV, pickup truck, or other big vehicles, a strap wrench is useful because the oil filter tends to be a little bit larger. A strap wrench is great at removing jammed oil filters on larger engines. These tools look more like a loop than traditional wrenches. They have a handle for turning and either a band, chain, or metal strap and loops around the cap. Their unique design makes them incredibly useful for oil filters. However, there is a downside, and that is that it can be slightly challenging to wrap the wrench onto the filter. Now let's look at the pliers. They have adjustable jaws and can be very powerful when it comes to removing tricky filters. And the pliers can remove filters of various sizes, plus they provide massive grip. The biggest complaint is that the pliers can distort or puncture the filter. Because it can be hard to turn the pliers without crimping the filter, the oil may leak and you may need to remove the filter in pieces. It may also be challenging to get the pliers to work if the filter is recessed. Now here are some key features to consider. First, the oil filter size. As you may require an oil filter wrench for small and large filters. After you determine what type of oil filter you have, then you can determine the proper wrench for the job. One way to find out what size of oil filter you have is by checking the owner's manual. You should also check where the filter is located and whether it's in a cramped space. Secondly, something with a good grip. The easier to use oil wrenches should have teeth with a solid grip. With a strong hold, it shouldn't be too hard for you to remove the oil filter cap. Conversely, if the grip is slippery, it'll take a lot more effort to complete the task and it'll make your job a lot more frustrating. And some other things to consider are the following. Focus on quality. Choose a wrench that's made of high quality materials. One of the worst things that could happen is breaking a wrench while changing the oil filter. If the wrench fails with very little pressure, it's probably made of low quality materials. The best quality oil wrench should be able to withstand your arm strength and also be able to loosen a tight oil filter. Also consider how easy it is to use. Because changing the oil filter is not very difficult when you have the right wrench that's easy to use. The best oil filter remover will have a solid grip and will not slip as it should have the ability to remove extremely tight oil filters with little effort. And complicated oil filter wrenches will make the job tougher. Also look at fit and adjustability. Oil filters have various diameters. Many brands of oil filter wrenches can be used on nearly all oil filters regardless of size. The best universal oil filter wrench will work on filters whether they're big or small. 
This is particularly useful if you have several vehicles with filters of various dimensions. You're also going to want to consider the wrench size, as some wrenches are larger than others. The bigger ones have longer handles and grips and can help you get to those areas in which the filter is harder to reach. And some may be too big to function properly if the filter is in a really tight spot. Lastly, a corrosion resistant finish is incredibly beneficial, especially if they're stored in areas that are prone to getting damp, such as a carport. It's common for metal tools to corrode or rust over time. A wrench with an anodized finish or coating will be less likely to rust. A rusty tool is harder to use and may not function properly. And even within each type of oil wrench, there are various versions, such as this one for Toyota-based vehicles that remove the cartridge-style oil filter system. And there you have it, a quick review of the most popular styles of oil filter wrenches. So make sure you help to keep this channel going by hitting that like button, sharing this video with a friend, and comment below as I reply to all. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you next time on Your Home Garage.